seems like you bitches have brought sweaty titties to a forklift fight. <laughs> Gotta tell y'all motherfuckers I'm forklift certified. You look like you spend your free time making Sigma male video edits in your basement. You ever notice how black people be like... It's not the myth that you... It's the amphetamine! I love those guys. Uh, has anyone here ever heard of the butterfly effect? Yeah, it's that thing where I give one of my homies butterfly kisses and it negatively affects our friendship. Shut your greasy ass up. Girl, you couldn't even last two minutes doing that. After I gave her the Glock Glock 9000, now I'm over here making her pick it up. You couldn't even last 30 seconds doing that. My legs hurt. Babe, I'm getting a cramp. Babe, please let me stop. I see what's happening here, right? I see what I'm doing and I don't like it. Being a quote unquote real man, right? Be willing to leave situation that you don't like, that you, you can't accept, is not fun. I think that's one of the hardest things is that usually when you do the hard thing, there's a benefit. You look better, people compliment you. You're like, fuck, you know, I did the right thing. Kind of hard, but had a big benefit. It's like hand and glove, okay? You need two, essentially you need like a real woman and a real man together for this to work. What do you think about that? I mean, don't be like, what have they done for you? It's good to like help people, but people take advantage of that. So when they ask you too much, then you say no. And to be upfront with you, there's no better way to say it than to just say it to their face. No. I'm doing it right now. Afraid of, are you uncomfortable in dealing with people being upset at you, like certain things? I mean, it's kind of like thing that no I was going to do. I was just kind of waiting for life. I have a job and I can support myself and she has a job and like there's income and that kind of thing. Are you um a sex addict? by Popeyes on the way. Nice. Uh -huh. It's like going down the steps from the uh, the, train. the train. There's a Popeyes there. There's a group of black guys across the street and there's like a bunch of people everywhere and I was like laughing and imagining myself being like Hey, y'all want some Popeyes? <laughs> I'm about to hit the guap and figure out my ass if there's kids. <laughs> y'all want me to get y'all anything? Yeah, hey, y'all want, hey. <laughs> just the world's yes. worst wigger. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I just moved. <laughs> I just moved here. <laughs> now I'm trying to make friends. Y'all, y'all trying to get y'all want some robots? Y'all ever heard the Chronic? Yeah. Any y'all that that guy and the Chronic guy would be best friends. Yeah. Yeah. He'd be like, he would be like, no, come on, crazy ass white boy. Come on, crazy Ernie. <laughs> he would love to be playfully racist. Oh at. man. Damn. Come on, crazy Ernie.